yachting, an industry where second best is not really good enough. Performance and quality are demanded by owners and operators alike. Interlux Yacht Finishes has been providing premium products to protect and beautify boats for three centuries. Marine fouling organisms present arguably the toughest challenge. As the world strives to be a cleaner and greener place, you need leaders to show the way. When the world's largest paint company turns its mind to a serious problem, you can expect a smart solution. The International Maritime Organization, IMO, has agreed a global convention to ban the application of TBT anti-foulings worldwide from January the 1st, 2003. Although the ban will not have immediate effect everywhere, many countries will implement their own ban through national legislation. In the European Union, the ban becomes effective from the 1st of January 2003, whilst in Canada it starts from the 31st of October 2002. Bans in Australia and the United States are expected to follow soon. Operators of vessels greater than 82 feet in length must carry documentary proof that they have not had TBT anti-foulings applied after the ban. Otherwise, they risk being prevented from entering many ports completely or face heavy fines. Unfortunately, conventional TBT-free anti-foulings simply don't match the performance of TBT-based products because the amount of biocide they release falls during their life until insufficient is released to deter fouling, whereas TBT anti-foulings release a constant amount of biocide throughout their life. Hard anti-foulings are very porous, so water penetrates the film, drawing out biocide and leaving a layer of resin at the paint surface, called the leached layer. It builds up continuously during the paint's life, until it blocks the release of more biocide and the coating fails. Eroding anti-foulings are also very porous. Water draws out biocide, leaving behind a leached layer but the leached layer is removed by the polishing action of water when the boat is in motion. However, when the boat is stationary, the leached layer builds up, trapping the biocide in the film. Therefore, if the boat is not used regularly, the amount of biocide released falls away. It is widely accepted that SPC coatings provide the benchmark for high-performance anti-foulings, but these contain TBT. As the ban takes effect, there will be no option but to sacrifice anti-fouling performance. To Interlux, this is unacceptable. As world leaders in high-performance anti-foulings, Interlux has spent 10 years and millions of dollars pioneering a new anti-fouling that has been proven to often outperform TBT systems. This is Micron 66. Micron 66 works in exactly the same way as TBT anti-foulings. TBT anti-foulings have given class-leading protection since their introduction by Interlux in the 1980s, simply because they are based on self-polishing copolymer SPC technology, not because they contain TBT. Micron 66 is based on intelligent SPC technology that has true SPC behavior that is free from TBT. It is unique patented and only available from Interlux. It also contains advanced biocides that are far superior to those used in TBT anti-foulings. This technology is called Biolux SPC. It gives outstanding results, making Micron 66 the new class leader. Both Micron 66 and TBT anti-foulings are based on SPC technology. They are very resistant to water, so biocide is not drawn out from deep inside the film. Instead, a chemical reaction takes place between the resin and the water at the surface of the film. This surface dissolves away, releasing biocide. In this way, the surface is constantly renewed and a leached layer is unable to form. 
A unique property of SPC anti-foulings, like Micron 66, is the sustained release of biocides throughout the entire life of the coating, without decline. This ensures the same high level of protection from the first day, right through to the last. Even when the boat is not used for long periods, biocide is constantly released, deterring fouling when it is needed most, making Micron 66 ideal for pleasure craft. The SPC technology behind Micron 66 has been used successfully for more than a decade on over 5,000 commercial ships worldwide. The results prove that its performance equals and in many cases outperforms the TBT systems. This is because the Biolux SPC technology used in Micron 66 incorporates advanced biocides that give outstanding protection against all types of fouling, from slime and algae to weed and shell fouling. The surface of Micron 66 continuously smooths and with use it actually becomes smoother than when first applied. The exceptionally smooth finish increases speed and reduces fuel usage. Although eroding anti-foulings polish with use, they don't smooth to the same extent as Micron 66. Hard anti-foulings actually roughen with use as holes open up the surface when the biocide is released. Another new anti-fouling from Interlux is Trilux 33. It has been designed especially for use on aluminum and is formulated with Biolux slime blocking technology. Trilux 33 is available in white and other bright colors. Best of all, no TBT license is required and it can be used on all types and sizes of boats. But Micron 66 is the choice for non-aluminum craft. It's based on the unique Biolux SPC technology that is patented and available only from Interlux. It offers increased speed and reduced fuel consumption as it smooths continuously. It continuously protects against fouling even when the yacht is not used for long periods. It has been proven over the last 10 years that Micron 66 often outperforms TBT anti-foulings making Micron 66 the new class leader.